the sabbath day is meant principally to put your mind on god you don't do that it's extremely necessary we are reviving the custom and one day at least a few hours you should wholly think of nothing but god or practice your meditations by which you feel that divine bliss and your whole week will be charged with the divine consciousness and because you don't observe that sabbath if you do not give one day even to your, your whole mind to god your week is full of worries and your months are full of worry and years of life spent in worry and the harvest of sin means error mistaken existence is death means a sorrowful change a sorrowful transition from this life to the other there is no death possible to the soul but why go out of this body in disaster in sorrow but if you observe the real sabbath of thinking of god and doing all activities for god or doing all activities with the thought of god that is the real sabbath suppose you pull up your bullock from the ditch with the thought of god on the sabbath day it's all right it is observance of sabbath if you keep on doing material things and think of god all the time still it's sabbath but if you do material things without the thought of god and thinking that you are observing sabbath it is not sabbath but if you meditate upon god as much as you can on the sabbath day that's the real sabbath but that does not mean that while you are thinking of god and somebody is dying in front of you and you say it's too bad it's sabbath day you got to die well god will say what's the matter with you i am dying in that body and you don't help me god is the one that's playing this drama and if you don't exercise the spirit of mercy and sympathy and love that he has given you you are not good at all in the eyes of god the best way to observe the sabbath is when you observe sabbath you are thinking of god today and we meditate some and then you come in the evening meditations because one day you should keep your mind on one subject god then it is real sabbath